What a strike. You must have been really pleased with that and thought you were on the way to three points. Oh, that's, I think that's what we were all hoping. I think as well as it turned out to be quite a disappointing day, so uh, the strike out means nothing. Because when it dropped out to you, you seemed to be the only one thought in your mind, I'm really am going to hit this. Well, to be honest with you, I couldn't see the ball, the sun was in my eyes. So I just thought, you know, I'd get out of my feet and just give it a go, really. And luckily, um, flew in the top corner, so yeah. Because it, it seemed a bit frustrating afternoon in many ways. You seemed to be well on top. Yeah. And, and I thought you were probably going to coast after uh, getting the opening goal. It wasn't to be, was it? Well, I think we all thought that, to be honest with you. I think first half we played quite well. I think we were the team on top. and. Yeah, I agree with you. I think we had a few more chances then where Simo's goal was, I think, maybe harshly disallowed. I think he might have been onside. But uh, fair play to Kurs and they came back and they stuck out here and they had a great goal at the end. Because that's on the back of two away games, which, yeah. you know, you came away there with, you know, what was it, four points from six away games. Mm -hmm. so you must have thought, well, you know, let's back that up now. Yeah, well, I think we all wanted to put in a good performance in front of our own fans because I think, again, they've shown their frustration, which they're more than entitled to. Because I think we've played reasonably well away from home, but I think we just can't for whatever reason seem to replicate that at home so far this season but hopefully we can uh, pick up a few more points yeah. Is it a question of switching off sometimes? You get perhaps thinking you know, the game's won? Um, I think there's a number of things. I think the goals for Kuzan I think they're both sloppy from us. I think they're very sloppy so there might be an element of concentration but I think there's uh, obviously a lot of things that go on in conceding a goal but at the end of the day it's not good enough. And you're, you're a slightly more advanced role now with the back three yeah. Uh, behind you, uh, is that helping your game? Um, I think so. I think I'm probably better going forward maybe than I am going backwards sometimes, and I'm open enough to admit that. But um, yeah, I think it gives me a bit more license to go forward, uh, to play one twos around the corners and stuff, and get some more balls in the box, and hopefully a few more goals as well. And it looks as though there's a shape uh, developing in the side, so it's not a question of you know a good result here and a reverse. So, you know, overall, uh, you seem to be picking up points. Yeah, well, I think our performance haven't been terrible whilst they haven't been great either i think we are slowly getting somewhere but i think there's definitely more positives and negatives even though we have lost today and there's a players coming back from injury competition for places yeah uh, and that has to be good for a footballer yeah definitely you've got to keep on your toes at all times it's no good when you one of you in one position you need to stay on your toes at all time and be fighting for your place uh, york city that looks to be a big game on yeah. Tuesday and, and Leamington another away game on Saturday so opportunity to, again to put this behind you and move on again. Yeah well they're not getting any easier are they? <laughs> <laughs> but now like I said we've got our heads up in there we'll just go again Tuesday and hopefully get, pick up three points if we can. Thanks for your time.